Welcome to the future of transportation. Meet Tressa Motors, India's pioneering manufacturer of medium and heavy electric trucks. Hello everyone, this is Prachit Tiwari for SME Futures and today we are interacting with Rohan Shravan, the founder and the CEO of Tressa Motors, who is on a mission to redefine transportation through innovation, safety and sustainability. Uh, 2020 is when we started Tressa Motors. Uh, when we uh, started uh, thinking about what is it that we actually want to make and uh, what can have the biggest impact, we realized that out of 100 trucks, 100 vehicles on the road, two are trucks and they contribute 50% of all the pollution. So that made the most logical sense to start in that domain. Uh, the next problem was that um, what is it that we can do actually very differently compared to the traditional OEMs and we realized that we have this IP that we can leverage, we can make one of the most efficient products out there and do it all in India while not depending on outside because from the first experience that I had, the, the IP had to be built. So that's how Tresa Motors was born to make trucks, to make logistics easier in India with the things that I've actually made here and not from outsourcing. Biggest challenge was to get people on board with the idea that this can be done. Uh, on the engineering side, uh, because uh, EV is such a new technology in India, we do not have a lot of engineers who have a prior experience, especially on the high voltage or heavy power side. We have low voltage engineers and people who worked on scooters and motorcycles. But uh, when you talk about something like truck, the skills are very different. Uh, the biggest challenge on the engineering event today is to find component that can support our 1000 volt and 48 volt architecture uh, on the high voltage and the low voltage side. Talk about uh, safety. Uh, in 2022, around 14,000 drivers died uh, in accidents, uh, one way or the other. We're talking about trucks here. And 90% uh, of the drivers, by the time they retire after 20 years driving these trucks, have a uh, uh, air issue. The uh, releasing capability drops on a lot. 50% drivers have eyesight issue. So in our trucks, we have ADA systems and LIDAR, which is essentially taking care of uh, what is there in the front, applying the brakes in case the driver is not able to apply. and. Uh, making sure that in the uh, situations where you do not have enough reaction time, the system can take over and actually control the truck instead of actually ramming into something. This is required for not only driver safety, but also the safety of the pedestrian. Now, when we go to sustainability part, we need to realize we are first, first of all comparing with the ICE engines. Of course, all EVs are uh, way more efficient. Uh, there are some questions uh, which were raised, which are being raised even today also that when we mine lithium and cobalt and nickel, then we also destroy environment. But if you look at the overall uh, carbon emissions from all of those activities and uh, compare that with gasoline, you're going to see that uh, EVs are still somewhere around five to six times better. The batteries themselves, especially for Tressa, the way we have designed a battery pack is 100% serviceable. So you can actually open Tressa battery pack, take a cell out and replace it with something that is uh, better. And that is not true for most of the battery packs out there. Uh, most of the battery packs are sealed and you have foam inside which locks them. But in our case, the design is very special where all the cells are uh, liquid submerged inside. Uh, some is inside liquid and we have serviceability at the ground level as well. Every decision that we have taken for uh, uh, with respect to our truck is driving on the efficiency side that these are one of the best uh, trucks on the ground which consume as low power as possible. Now that is possible by using the motors that are very very optimal. Uh, this is also possible when the voltages are high. Our truck are designed for 1000 volt uh, to be worked at. Uh, it is also uh, making sure that it's very aerodynamic. Then you have autonomous system also that is helping understand whether uh, you have elevation coming in front of you or you can actually use a slope. A uh, 55 ton truck running on a road at 50 kilometers is a lot of momentum. You can use that momentum to drive a long distance. So we invented something very special there where today in our battery pack there is zero solder. We do not have any solder requirement and yet we have one of the lowest overall battery pack resistance compared to even the best out there. Uh, the submersible uh, technology also allows us to uh, not actually provide active cooling. All the all the packs at uh, Tressa trucks are actively cooled, but they're actually not required unless we are charging the truck at a high speed. And this also allows us to charge batteries at a very high speed and that's how we can achieve uh, 10 to 80 percent of charge for these batteries in under 22 minutes using one megawatt of charges, which will soon uh, come probably in a couple of years in the Indian context also. If you look at our truck, we are trying to uh, minimize tooling as much as possible. The whole cabin is actually designed from laser cut panels that are now attached to a space frame. So that is also something which, which is very unique, which allows us to actually enter the market. As of today, uh, what the data, data that we have, we are around uh, 35 to 40% better than the competition on Indian roads. It's a good number to start. Second, uh, we are a uh, 
we have a lot of automotive experience with respect to the engineers that are there but as a company this is the first time we are entering uh, and especially uh, manufacturing and providing a truck earlier we have had experience in different fields so the most important test that we have internally is to actually run our trucks for at least a million kilometers with actual load on the truck with actual partners and we are partnering with uh, people who are really interested in understanding how this technology works so this test on the ground is actually of uh, you can say resultant of how safe and how uh, efficient a truck is because now you have actually data to validate the claims that we are making So uh so our trucks are designed uh, with different versions uh, we started with V0 then we had V0.1 now we have V0.2 and we'll have future updates also coming very soon uh, these are the uh, fundamental updates that go on a truck now V1 was a, a pure prototype uh, which was uh, to ensure that the overall architecture is done well uh, at V1 we went to 800 volt and uh, I made our own power train and ensured that we are hitting the uh, milestone that we are interested in that for the first time that we made a, a battery pack in that uh, that was supposed to sit inside the chassis and the battery packs are also slide in so we are not looking at a swappable batteries but we are already thinking about manufacturing that how do we actually make sure that batteries can actually be hosted inside the chassis so that was one of the biggest uh, test in uh, uh, test that we looked at uh, not only it allowed us to make the batteries uh, battery location one of the safest on a truck it also allowed us to reduce a lot of weight from the chassis because the battery frame itself can act like a uh, you can say a load bearing structure so that that was one good thing that came out of v1 v2 has its own updates uh, the voltage low voltage system went from 12 to 24 our next uh, system is at 48 volt we increase our nominal voltage also uh, earlier the peak voltage was 800 now the nominal voltage is 800 and now the next time uh, we're looking at 1000 volt as our main max maximum voltage Oh uh, so uh if you happen to be in Bangalore uh, visit us sit in our truck uh, and decide for yourself is this future or not we believe it is we are putting our heart in designing uh, something very unique from this country we want india to be proud of uh, this product so we're doing all in our control and uh, if you partner with us uh, you'll also learn about how evs are going to perform and change the uh, country to come uh, country in the time to come but uh, yeah together we can <laughs> Tesla Motors is not just building trucks but is reshaping the future of transportation through relentless innovation a commitment to safety and a vision for sustainability they are driving forward towards a cleaner greener and safer world thanks for joining us today remember to like share and subscribe for more fascinating stories in the world until next time take care and keep exploring